Hi, I'm Anthony Smith and I'm a general practitioner. In what seems an era ago, I watched with horror as colleagues around the world, in China, Italy, Spain, London and New York, became overwhelmed with the chaos and confusion of an illness that they just didn't understand. It became clear that it would not take long before the same illness, the COVID-19 virus, surged on our own shores. We've benefited from a hard initial lockdown, which has flattened our curve and given us time to prepare because it's in preparation that we're going to be able to help those around us and prepare ourselves for what is almost certainly inevitable. It's during this time of preparation that a group of family practitioners realized that working together, they'd be much more effective in helping the community than working in their individual siloed offices. So we came together and we started an initiative called Masks for Medics. Masks for Medics is a disaster management plan which is aiming in the event of a COVID surge to help keep you safe in your homes by helping and keeping healthcare workers who work in the community safe. There are carers of the elderly, there are emergency response personnel, there are general practitioners, there may be community nurses, they could be physiotherapists or occupational therapists or palliative care workers. Really, anybody who works in your home during a time when resources are very thin and hospitals are overwhelmed. We do a few things. What we do is provide personal protective equipment, PPE. These will include gowns, masks, visors, coveralls, sanitation, and we also help to provide the training, which is so important in being able to use the PPE effectively. We also realize that we need to be monitoring the patients effectively. And so we are also looking to provide vital instruments like thermometers uh, and also pulse oximeters to be able to effectively treat patients as they are in the community. We are embarking on a big plan. We want to extend this plan through from the central Cape Town out into the townships and into the Cape Flats. And we're looking to create partnerships with colleagues who are similarly inclined to do the same. We urge you to help us in this endeavor and to support us in being able to keep you safe at home.